Peace. I'm Dr. Delete, and you're watching Credit Healing. Peace, fam. Welcome back to another video with Credit Healing LLC. Today, we're going to be talking about something that many Americans are currently facing, and that's credit card debt. And the reason that we are talking about this particular subject is because there are things that you can do in regard to your credit cards that you may not be aware of. Now, millions and millions of Americans are in credit card debt just due to various factors, the economy, trying to make investments, um, and other factors that are involved. Well, there's a solution in many cases that you may not be aware of, and that is hardship assistance. So many banks, especially now, are actually offering financial or hardship assistance uh, to consumers such as yourself. The reason why is because they understand that with the interest rates and the, the mortgage and just a lot of things that are going on, it makes things kind of shaky. So they want to be able to assist people without necessarily harming or hurting the American populace. So with that said, we want to talk about how you can go about basically applying for hardship assistance with your lender um, or your bank and then allowing them to be able to assist you in a manner in which you don't have to pay um, every month. And then you also don't have to, uh, you know, basically have these derogatory items reporting on your credit report because you are making uh, late payments. So this is the strategy. If you are late or if you are in credit card debt, this is what you would do. You would just simply call your lender, call your bank and say, um, hey, you know, I am late on my credit cards. Can I apply for the hardship assistance program? Do you all have one available? If you've never applied for one within the past 12 months, most likely they're going to say yes. There are times that they may not have them available, but right now they do have them available in many cases. So what's going to happen is they're just going to get some financial information. They ask you for your income, et cetera, et cetera. You give them their information. They're going to ask you, okay, so what, um, what caused this particular issue? You can say, Hey, you know, I got, you know, I just uh, had these repairs on my home or I just had these uh, issues that I faced um, with employment and I don't want to be late. Um, but I do have some financial obliga obligations and you could tell them this and they will completely understand. So then what they will do is they will say, okay, well, um, yeah, let me look and see if we have a program when they do that, then um they're going to see what's available and if it's available then they're going to basically assist you and what's going to happen is they're going to take these particular um they're going to take say for instance the payments that you have to make within the next two to three months and say you're not going to have to make these payments we're going to just reduce your payment down to let's say a hundred dollars 150 dollars that you'll pay three months later we won't close the account you'll just make this payment and for the next few months, you don't have to make any payments because we're going to cover it as a bank, a banking institution. They make a lot of interest um, off of many people in terms of for their credit card. So they have the money to cover. Don't be afraid to communicate with your lender because if you do not, <clears throat> then what's going to happen is you can become delinquent on your credit card. Your credit scores will then drop and then, after uh, that happens within the next seven years, you have to wait for the item to either fall off or you can reach out to us and then we'll dispute it to get it removed from your credit report. So we want to let you know that there is hope for your credit card situation. You should have time uh, this week, next week, etc. And call, call them and say, hey, I'd like to see if there's some type of hardship assistance program um, and I would like to apply for it because I'm going through X, Y, and Z, and they should assist you because obviously you as the consumer, they do care about you and they do want for you to have the best experience with that bank. And they obviously don't want for the account to be charged off because there's a lot of things that they have to get, you know, their uh, legal uh, team involved, their attorneys when they charge off the account and they'll have to sell it, et cetera. So, so they don't want that to happen. So I do want to let you know that um, I hope that you all are having a great week. Um, I hope that you all are having a great month. And if you have any questions, you can reach out to us at contact at or, or 
credithealing at gmail.com. And if you're ready to get started and if you need to improve your credit, go to www.credithealing.org. Mail, when I send it off, um, I'm going to show you the receipt that comes with it, which is a false step. So, bear with me, family, and stay tuned, and I'll show you exactly what to do.